Hi Steve, and uh, thanks for your follow-up um, video, mate. What I see, mate, I'm very impressed. You've done everything that I asked in the last one, and it looks really, really good. So we're just going to get really picky now for you uh, and slow everything down. Um, okay, so really to start off with some positives, your push arm height there is coming through beautiful. It's finishing across just on that opposite shoulder, which is great. So no need to change that on this path. The one thing here is on your right elbow, you can just notice that right elbow creeps out a little bit and therefore when it's out then your hand accelerates up out of the water. So we just want to tuck that elbow in a little bit mate and then lift that whole arm up. On your left hand side, the left elbow just sneaks back in there around your body, that one was alright. But some of them just kind of come back in so you're pulling that blade back into your body which we don't really want to do. So let's just get this one underway here there you can just see that right elbow just sort of coming out a little bit there a bit too wide so we can just bend that arm a little bit more get the blade closer to the ski uh, push arm height there is good maybe if anything the left arm isn't coming across as far as I'd probably like and it's just dipping away there a little bit at the end so <coughs> So slowing down this back angle there, you can just see that that left one's just down a bit where the right one stays up there and you can see it. Mate, the one thing I noticed here is you're falling away from that right side. So just try and keep your right shoulder down as you go down to the catch. Keep that right shoulder down and then hold that down all the way through. That'll hopefully pull your elbow in and therefore you'll be able to pull closer to the boat. So there you can just see you're throwing yourself across to the left. I know you're in a K1 and your balance might be a little bit off, but on the left one there, you, you can see your shoulder blade coming back into your spine. That's exactly what we want there. So that's a beautiful stroke, that one. And there, you can just see that that shoulder wants to stay popped forward and not necessarily come back. But, mate, good shoulder rotation there. I can't really see uh, the leg drive on these angles, but I'm sure that uh, you're doing that as well. I think we've just got a final one here to... So here just to finish off a little bit, so no, that's all good mate. So just a few things here, what's good, is push arms a good height, coming across body well, shoulder rotation's excellent. Just work on that right elbow not going out so far uh, and lifting with the hand too much. By doing that, just try and keep that right elbow in. But mate, you're doing a really, really good job. Keep up the good work and look forward to hearing from you again soon.